All right. Welcome back. It is the new season, season three of new books. We're going to start with a series. There's a series called Pig the Pug, and it's been very popular in our library. So I ordered some more titles in that picture book series. So we now have Pig the Fibber. Kind of like a lie. Maybe not as bad as a real lie. Pig the Tourist. Pig the Slop. And this is my favorite cover. Pig the Rebel. Alright, then we also have books that come together in a series called Why Are We Afraid? And... Why do we cry? <sighs> okay. Sorry. Then we have a picture book that's also nonfiction, and it's all about animal food chains. You know how one animal eats a plant, and then a bigger animal comes and eats that animal, and it just keeps going and going and going? This is called Creep, Leap, Crunch, a food chain story. It looks great. Then, I was really excited. I found some copies of really old comics and they made them into collections. And we have now, for the very first time, the original X-Men. Like way before Wolverine and other characters joined the X-Men, this is what they look like. And it is a collection of the first 20 issues of the comic all collected in one big book. And it will be on the new book wall and then eventually our superhero shelf. We also now have Fantastic Four, the very first 20 issue comics again, all in one treasury collection. Fantastic Four. Then for our chapter book fans, whoa, I almost fell. <laughs> all right, everything's cool. For our chapter book fans, if you are ready for a new adventure, this looks pretty awesome. I have not read it yet, let me know. It is called A Rover's Story, and it is about a rover on Mars and the adventures that it has. This would probably be great for my fourth grade readers. Then, if you like chapter books, but you're just starting, you want a lot of pictures, and you also like series like Owl Diaries, we also now have a lot of the Unicorn Diaries. We have number one all the way to number seven. And they'll be on our new book wall. And then eventually they'll make their way over to our swivel rack. All right, I hope you found something that you might wanna take home and read. If not, let me know. Maybe there's a book out there that I just didn't buy, but maybe I should. <laughs> Feel free to go grab a piece of paper anytime and write it down for me. And, you know, try to make sure it's a book you think that other kids would want to read too. Alright, take care. Bye.